Why a wine glass can sing? A wine glass can sing when you rub your wet finger along its rim because of a phenomenon called resonance. Resonance occurs when an object vibrates at its natural frequency, and in the case of a wine glass, this natural frequency is determined by its shape and the thickness of the glass. On its natural frequency, an object can vibrate more easily than other frequencies. In the case of a wine glass, the rim of the glass is a key area where it can vibrate. When you rub your wet finger along the rim of the wine glass, you create friction. This friction causes the glass to vibrate. If you have water on your hand, the water on your finger helps to reduce friction, allowing the glass to vibrate more freely. The vibrations produced by your finger rubbing the rim are transmitted throughout the glass. As the glass vibrates, it deforms slightly, flexing back and forth. This deformation generates sound waves in the air, which we perceive as sound. If you find the right speed and pressure while rubbing your finger along the rim, the glass will start to vibrate at its natural frequency. When the frequency of your finger's movement matches the glass's natural frequency, it results in a more pronounced vibration and a clear, musical tone. This is resonance in action. The vibrations generate sound waves that we hear as a musical tone. The pitch of the tone can change based on the amount of water on your finger, the pressure applied, and the speed at which you rub the rim. It is important to note that there are some key factors to make a glass sing a beautiful song. The type of glass you choose is essential. Wine glasses, crystal glasses, or glasses with a thin rim tend to produce clearer and more melodious tones. Also, your finger needs to be wet, as this reduces friction and allows the glass to vibrate more easily. The water on your finger serves as a lubricant. Experiment with the amount of pressure to find the right balance for the best results. Start rubbing your wet finger along the rim slowly. Gradually increase the speed until you find the glass's natural frequency, at which it will start to vibrate more prominently. The glass will produce a clearer tone when the rubbing speed matches its resonance frequency. Thanks for watching. If you like the video, please hit the like button or subscribe button for more interesting topics.